Welcome back to Captain of Industry. My name is Nilaus and I am your captain here on this uh, island. I don't know what captains are doing on islands, but whatever, that is what we do. Uh, I wanted to do a little bit of the stuff between sessions so that we could complete all of this, but that was not really a uh, an option, not a viable option. Reason why? Because this game is not the way that Satisfactory is, where you can just leave it and uh, walk away from it. No, 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 no. What will happen is that if we look at our resource overlay, there is no more oil here. So we are completely screwed when it comes to oil. We do have a little bit of uh, of diesel left here and we're getting a tiny, tiny bit of rubber, but that facility up there is done. What we need to do today or what we want to do today is we're going to take our beautiful build here and we're going to be converting it into a, I don't know, I kind of feel like a food market, but it's also just not food. But the thing is, this is produced at a variable rate because at some point we'll be getting fertilizer in and we can't really determine exactly how much we use or produce because it's also very uh, varying depending on the population, the composition of the diets, all that stuff. So there's many variables. So we need something that doesn't jam and always has an overflow. And that overflow will make uh, make more fertilizer, organic fertilizers, so that we can sort of speed this up as well. And uh, also just, uh, yeah, just have a way to, to do that. So that will be the main part. But we have a few disasters to avert beginning. Uh, the first one is, well, uh, I did have one thing that I wanted to do, and that was over here. I have built these research labs three and slapped that one in here. Got a little paper plant here as well. Uh, kind of felt that that was needed. It's a kind of a, it's a really trivial build and it's not really pretty, but it, it needed to be done because I needed to get this. And the reason why was because I wanted to, for sort of design purposes, I wanted to get, um, where are you? Where are you? Somewhere. Somewhere there's a, hmm, there's a bigger box. There we go. Large storage box. Yes. And then we are also starting working on the bridge and the ship uh, things because we want to get the ship out there and working. Now, first disaster to avert is we need to reestablish. This is, by the way, a hack. So it's not really super fun and interesting. So we'll just be zooming past until I make it. So I'm going to be reestablishing some rubber down here. And I'm also going to take a little bit of the sour water and then convert it into some sulfuric acid. No, some sulfur because we're going to need that for tofu. I don't know why you'd want that for tofu and then throw the rest in here. But those are temporary builds, so don't copy them. Just know that they will be here. So we built our new rubber plant. It's very simple. We're just leaching a little bit of the coal coming from here and we have uh, have it in route. It's building. We need it up here and then we also get the diesel on the other side. We also have something here. This is a little sulfur plant. We'll just make 12 sulfur that's going to be used for tofu and nothing else and the water it gets thrown in the water and the ammonia just gets flared i know we could do something better but i have no intention of doing that and now here this will just basically go try to fill this box up if you can't uh, fill it out anymore then just go here so that means we can at least consume the 32 of this uh, which will uh, 36 this is producing okay so half of this will be able to be consumed and converted here so we are getting rid of a lot of that so now we get up to all the points here that uh, all the wheat, the soybeans, the co copper, copper, what? How's the, why is the copper so, oh, you know what? I unpaused the copper at some point, but I never really built those uh, intermediate things. So I think this will probably help on the copper. Nice. <clears throat> okay, let's uh, forget that. Uh, now up here, we are also going to upgrade all these. Now, not going to make any difference right now because there's nothing really to upgrade. Uh, the, there is no flow. Uh, but once there's a flow, it'll be better. There, 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 there. And that one was upgraded. This one will also get upgraded. I'll just keep the flow all on this main line here. Make sure that's up. All right, so let's get started on the topic of today. Now, I want to make sure that we have the potatoes uh, can will be brought firstly into the city markets and then secondarily I'll be taking from this one uh, which will also go out but it will only be going out to special things so that means like we want to make sure that it doesn't jam the line when one of these is full as it does now because we have nothing that consumes wheat that is not good so uh, we need to start building something now we can look at uh, let's look at wheat for example there. So what can we do with it? We can obviously make it into flour. That's the main one. But if we have all the flour and the flour can be made into bread, that's really good. 
once we have all of that, we're still going to need to do something with the rest. And that could either make it into animal feed, or we can make it into compost, which will become fertilizer, and fuel gas, which will just be fuel for whatever. So this will be my main one of uh, what I need to do. But I also need to make sure that compost gets converted into, where is the conversion here, plus water, into some fertilizer. Good. So this is why we want to build something over here and just get a little bit a sense of uh, what, why, where. And I'm going to pick one of those big ones here. And they will be, they won't be flush against this line, but they will be kind of one, Two? Two seems good, right? Two is okay. I don't know. I don't really have a hard and fast rule on how far they should be. But let's take it two away. So this one will be the storage of the organic fertilizer. And how do we want to make it? We make organic fertilizer in the machine that's used all the time in the mid-game. <laughs> Way too much in the mid-game, actually. And that will be here. It's used for everything in the mid-game. It is used for... There, fertilizer. Okay, so that's one, and we're gonna get two of these, and that will be split one between them. I'll copy this and get the water into the middle. Maybe we'll actually make it just up there, just because, and there. That is wrong. That seems like a good location for it. And they will go in, let's look at the quantity, that's 48. Ooh, that needs to be the good ones then. Make sure we get the right pipes, and there. Yeah, this will then be the first thing. We're going to need to find water somewhere. Then we also need to get all of this inbound, and we'll get that on a belt. Uh, flat conveyor, how much is this? This is 36. We'll just start with a normal one. We'll go in. Oh, nope. It'll go with a U-shape here. Inbound. And inbound and that will come up from somewhere up here we'll kind of have a i'm gonna almost call it a bus but not really what about this this is also just nicely uh, cleaned up so we have some more space now the next part is how do we make composts compost is used is a is a byproduct of a lot of things uh, we also have like sludge and fruits and puppies and meat trimming all those things are things that will eventually be a be composted if we want it Veg uh, potatoes can be composted, vegetables can be composted, and wheat can be composted. Good, 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 good. So those will be things, but they all involve the anaerobic digester. So let's get the anaerobic digester in here. And that can actually be doing a lot of things, right? If I build another one here, and then the middle one should be two. And we'll build four of those. And they will all be, just take all the recipes that we have available. And also make sure that they both have off here. Uh, that's this one. Copy and paste, 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 paste. Yeah? Good. So that needs to go out. They will only have... Oh, right. And then we just rotate it because that's obviously how it has to be. This will... Now I could just bring it right in, but that would be cheating, wouldn't it? Hmm. Well, at least it's ground level, so I'm just going to bring it up. I don't know if I need to bring it any further up than this. But now we are here and here. And I kind of don't like this being so close. So let's go a little bit closer like that. And there's only some water coming in, which we also need to figure out on two. I'll get that up to level two and then also go up here somehow. So somehow up there, water. But no, water's not a problem. We can leach it off this location if we want to. But I'm going to bring uh, the compost collected up the top and... That is compost and also some gas, some fuel gas. So we let's let's get some fuel gas in here. Ooh, do I want a big one? I really want a big one, don't I? Yeah. I really want a big one for the fuel gas. I don't think it's going to be relevant, but it would be nice. There. Okay, so this is... <laughs> This is kind of uh, horrifying, isn't it? It's not very much of this. So let's go a little long. This is a good location. And it'll just be height one. There. And we built the rest in here. Merge it in. Funny how it doesn't want to go like this. 
Yeah. There you go. So that works. Now we need stuff inbound. There's two things inbound. One is on a flat conveyor and one is on a flat conveyor. So they will definitely need to be... Well, they also definitely need to be faster, I think. So this is uh, the next little bit done. And uh, we also have... We're still having issues with stuff coming out. And we'll just allow that to happen. We do have a, a new things out here. We're going to load 60 of the crew in here. We have upgraded the ship engine and the ship bridge. We don't have the weapons, but we still have 210 and we can now reach a lot further. So we could start exploring those locations out here and hope that we don't run into some nasty pirates out there. Now, back up to this one. There is another way to make compost because we're still working on the sort of the final piece of the chain, the trash part of the train. And that is actually... If we look at here, this will be, hmm, where is it? That one, the animal feed 12 there. That is definitely an important one here. And then we'll have it here and then we'll have it. Uh... Funny how that doesn't seem to be aligned with this one. Yeah, that does not seem to be aligned. Oh, it's because this one is smaller, I guess, uh, but it, it works. So this will be another way of, uh, of getting stuff outbound here. We will go all the way up and then merge it back into the compost line. Whoa, that's, that was weird. There. Oops, we're fighting, that's not good. We are not strong enough for the stuff we're gonna find out there. There. And then we need to figure out, so that's Animal feed. Animal feed is a byproduct that we're going to get a lot of things. Oh, look at that. We actually made it. Sweet. We got it. And we got another oil rig. Sweet. And they're flying back. Flying back. Now, <clears throat> here is a thing. Uh, we are definitely going to get a lot of animal feed inbound. So I am going to already now assume that we are going to get like that with a fast build. So we just have to make sure that we don't continue to use the fast belt but it's definitely going to be a fast belt out here uh, it's definitely irrelevant because no, i'm kind of thinking whether it is relevant or not there and then we can get a box of goodies that's going to be a large box because we will potentially have a lot of this and that will be here and we get that in so we now have a quick belt moving up here with all of our animal feed. And then we sort of, hmm, there. Then we have to step back and say, okay, from now on, if we get any excess animal feed, any excess wheat, any excess potatoes, any excess vegetables, we have a way to deal with it. And that's gonna get into uh, becoming fertilizer and fuel, very valuable components, fully repaired, great. And then we need now need to say, well, there's other ways that we can end up making making this animal feed and uh, because animal feed is another way that we can uh, burn through excess materials for example for wheat no but for corn and for soybeans that's the way we can get it and probably something else uh, maybe even maybe even biomass yeah and maybe uh, definitely something else as well that we'll get to so that is a yet another one of these builds and this one is Somehow that last one is going to be misplaced a little bit. Is that? I knew it. It didn't feel right. It didn't feel right. It was one off. It didn't feel right. There we go. Now this is better. Here. So these will also again do this. That means now we have a way to get rid of excess corn and excess soybeans and excess biomass that we don't have yet, but we can will get it soon. That will be the same build as down here with multiple locations where we can get stuff in. We will also make it room for even more than what we have right now. So that will be, uh, it could be biomass, it could be soybeans, and it could be corn. So let's merge those in here. So this was actually, honestly, the most boring part of it. This is all the waste product. We, don't, we haven't even done any of the stuff that we want to make. So let's start get started on the stuff that we really want to make. And that will actually be, where are we? Bread. Yay. Let's make bread. So bread is exceedingly easy. And let's see, we'll make one of these. Oops. 
I don't know if we need to, how much space we need to have for it. And a baking unit as well. There. That will be here. And ship weapons is done. There we'll go. Queue up the ship weapons. Here. Upgrade weapon. Upgrade weapon. Oh, that's going to be expensive, but I will do it. And while I am designing away. All right. So this... Um, might as well have you queue into that. And we. what are we going to get in here? We are only going to get the... We, and then we also get a tiny bit of this outbound. Let's see. Let's uh, rotate this. And I want to flip it and rotate it again. So that the wheat comes in directly there. And that goes back into a build like this. And I will also get another wheat here. That one. This is the intentional one and ratio wise 16 in 16 out 16 in 24 out 24 out is pretty damn good and this will now be a slim line and it'll be oh really this is going to be a bigger one yeah this is going to be a big build so but the merge is going to be here so that merges in and gets water in very, very simple. Now, what do we have here? We have... That is going to be also merging into this line. But I don't know if I want to have it... I definitely don't want to have it on line one. There. Right? Because line one is potentially compost. And if we get something else that generates compost, we want to be able to push it that way. Now, is this a good location? Hmm. I could definitely squeeze it a little bit closer. Let's do that. There, this is good. And uh, I've left this one in because I don't know if I need another one inbound, but I think I do. And then I have a little bit of room that's just three wide, this space in here. And that means they can drive in here if they want to. Now, that is good. Now, the next one we want to build is a little bit more silly. Uh, that will be also starting from here. And I'm going to make, again, leave three one two three that will be not bread but tofu which is a chemical disaster but um, i guess it's edible one two and three so what do we want inbound here well we want uh, first of all the soybeans that makes sense then we want uh, limestone that makes no sense and then we want some sulfur that makes even less sense and those three things just get smashed into a food processor which we're going to be building here and let me see, this can only do this part. Yeah, it's insane, but it makes 12 of tofu and I can definitely not get more than nine soybeans. Soybeans grow really slowly, but this should be, and uh, let's see if this one, nah, there. So you can go in here and this one can go in here. And you can go into. That's weird. Okay. Uh, the... Oh, right. It's because there's a little input here that we're not using. And I'm going to do it that way as well. There you go. That looks good. Good enough. And water. We know we can... how we get that. And we get this one. Oh, no. These are. This belt here. Come on, and there. Why is it using that belt? I really don't want it. I wanted to use the flat conveyor belt one. There. And this is flat conveyor one. Yes, they require yellow. And the only thing we're missing is here. A little bit of resources to go onwards down into the belt and get taken care of. Then we also have the water. We'll turn around the corner here and then go two up and hook it up to the main line. Yeah, we could have built the main line closer, but it needs to fill in this part. Now, I don't think I need more. Like, obviously... Oh, no. No, you silly noobs. You kidding me? Oh, I hate this part. Oh, no. I am traumatized by this. I am so traumatized. Ugh, that was so good. It was so good. Right. Disaster is kind of averted, and it's pretty clear that we have an issue here. I'm trying to sort of make it a little slope up here. 
uh, against this. Uh, it was advised in my ch stream that that might work. So we'll give it a shot and then see if we can sort of make slopes up against this and then it won't collapse. But it'll probably collapse. Anyway, uh, more interestingly is this one. Because all we need now is water inbound, which I can very much get. I don't want to risk taking this one because this is for power. So I'm going to get a new water just right here. It's not going to be very big and it's not going to be very uh, efficient. It's just going to be 48, which is ample for what we need. So um, let's just get it in here. And let's get some power lines or water lines that goes in this one goes one two and it goes up to the water line great and then the water line will now be flipped around flip and yeah yeah yeah. i know this doesn't work uh that's also funny how it's the wrong it's the slow one there and there and probably the other way cool so now all i need to do is i think fire this up i haven't set up any uh, request or anything but let's fire it up and see how fast we can build it while we wait for the construction to complete let's head out with our new ship uh let's see how big is the ship how good is it it is now 430 so can we take this out oh yes let's go out there there's loot out here let's go and while we look at it, <laughs> I have restored a little bit of this. I've decided not to uh, mine the closer one, this field here. And that's, of course, because it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven tall. And this one can only reach five. So obviously that's going to be a problem. And uh, yeah, that's obviously problematic. Let's see if we can get a little bit more here. Uh, we're going to wait for all of this to be completed. And I have tried to disable everything with the inbounds and outbounds, but some things just got in here. So why not start a new massive project while we're working on uh, on waiting for this? Firstly, I will take all of this out firstly. Is that even a word? I'm going to take all this out. Uh, and I'm going to do that because that will be uh, just... That will be useful for our building over on the side. Now that we have recovered all those ingredients. Hopefully some will be help be brought in here. Yeah, it's still not quite done, but it'll get there. Now, what do we want to make in terms of a... Build. Now, look at this glorious thing. If we only we could get out there. The thing is, if we look at contours, then this has like a small little hills. They are not very interesting. While over here, this is actually just goes step up here and then another step up here. Now, what if we just kill all this step up here? At least some of it. Which, and then start moving from... Oh, hello. Oh, there's actually more oil here. But uh, move from this location outwards. So let's see, if we start by looking at this one here, and then from here, I'll start flipping it down. And there, one, two, six, speed, height six. What is the height we have over on this side? This is height three. Okay, so we go all the way down to height three. There. And then we, at this point, we flatten it. Height three. I know you could go to height four, uh, height two, but I don't need it. I'd rather have it the same place as everything else. Yeah, and just a little bit more. And there you go. So that's uh, that's good. And that's not really going to get there uh, anytime soon. So what we want to do is we want to help it out a little bit by making a mine control tower. And we'll just make it here. This one will be in charge of this area. And at this point, I also want to say, don't drop trash in the ocean. Oh, I don't know if I even like myself when I say this. The other thing I want to do is if I level this terrain up here, this starts at level something. Yep, there. All of this terrain can very easily, well, not easily, but it can be leveled like this. And it has like these nice contours. So if we start by just flattening all of this, that would be uh, really nice. There we go. And we probably also should get some more uh, here. Yeah, okay, you're working up here. That's fine. And then I'm going to get another one of these and I'll just build it, I don't know, somewhere like this. This will also be upgraded fast. And I will be just taking probably like this area. There we go. 
and we're gonna get four of these in here and then we're gonna get 10 because now we have all we want we have 100 vehicles so by having these they will be cleaning up flattening this area and dumping it if i just mark it like this then they will be they will be outbounding it to that that should be good so that is the next little bit of a project let's see if we can now complete this still not well i guess we just wait i found a way to get more resources and we're not going to need these anymore because we have tons of uh, other food, I think. There, vegetable, vegetable, potato, potato, corn, corn, uh, bread, bread, tofu, tofu. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So they are uh, all very dead. <laughs> and that should give us a lot of resources back here again, leaving us available to build all of it, except for that one. You're the only one that can't be built. All right. Well, you'll get it eventually. Let's uh, bump you up so as fast as possible. Now, we can now do all the things that we want. And this is important. Now, for example, this will be... The, these ones will just be getting in and a notification if empty. This one will be getting in and notification if empty. This one, getting it in, notification if empty. Sure. This one, don't care. Um, this one... Inbound notification of empty. Don't care. It'll it is what it is. And here now, if I make this also open, then it will compete between here. Uh, hold on. Yeah, it'll be competing between the corn here and the corn back in my home location. But you can't eat raw wheat. You can't eat raw soybeans. So this will be the primary way place they want to go in. So. This one has to be only taking the excess. This one should only take the excess. So let's start with this. You don't want to do anything like this. So let's look at the soybeans. The soybeans is up here. Now what I can do is I can take this and make that an outbound, but then link it so that it can only go to that one. That is the one. So now it'll try to empty anything that is above like just passing through so that almost all of it will go obviously into the first location now i'm going to do the same thing for the wheat that's super important that will be out here and then switches over but i want to force the wheat to go into hmm that one nope that's not it uh take that out and let's see where's the wheat this one i'll just make it an import source instead it's going to be the same thing there right so wheat goes any excess wheat goes into the conversion and oh we got a battle we got a location puppy seeds sweet what about now this one is 470 this is 470 that's a little bit much we'll be just going out here and take some other things now potatoes we also need to get those out so here we'll do the same thing mark that as out and hmm which one was the potatoes Hmm, I can't remember. That's the potatoes. All right, cool. Let's do it the other way around. Potatoes, there you go. So any excess potatoes goes out there. Any excess vegetables, yeah, go into that one. Good, so you got something, you don't, you have something, you, we don't have biomass yet. Uh, this is soybean and corn is not coming in, so corn, is coming in from there it is there and figure out which one was the corn <laughs> that one right yes so now all i should have something that is pretty robust against any uh any surplus or any uh, overflow ship and battle ship and battle that i don't care about this web here we got it uh no we did not get it we came in second location explored oh we got my okay we got that one but there's another one that's a little bit tougher right so now we actually have entirely our food production going we got some bread we got some tofu and by getting tofu we are also now enabling well if they actually eat the tofu here we got a little bit of tofu and that gives us now a bonus because there are three categories satisfied 12 uh 12 over here that's oh panic i know someone commented on this on the last belt 
Wait, what is what is up? Is it is it that one? <gasps> no, you gotta be kidding me, right? And this one will also be an upgraded pipe. Yes. And I'll get one more of these. I guess we know what we're going to be doing in the next episode. That is definitely going to be more of this part here. And just do some kind of uh, clever waste waste management production thing here. There we go. Get that out. And look. Jump, jump. Here, here. Hit R to get in. There we go. Because this uh, needs to evacuate a lot of wastewater. Good. And there we go. So this one is now using 91. It gets enough inbound. It's great. Uh, these are just getting thrown in the water. That's not ideal. Oh, look at this. This is trash. But I think this is landfill. Hmm. So after a while, trash becomes landfill, and while it is still trash, it um, it counts well. It landfill. Then it counts as a negative thing. So we should kind of not spend too much. But I guess over time, I think it was five, four years, it will convert. Now I think this. Uh, let's look up here and see if this is. Oh, look at that! This is beautiful. How this is going. Uh, that's gonna take a little bit of time, but you know, it's one of those projects that eventually it'll get done, and then we'll be happy. Uh, now we also have food done in a really nice way. I'm going to just leave it here. So in case you want to just uh, screenshot it and uh, just build something along the lines. Of course, if you are a Patreon supporter of the channel, then you can also just download the save games and then grab and manipulate and take a save, take a, uh, take blueprints and all that as you want. Now, obviously, we're not going to get much out here. This one, we have to get a warning if it's full because that's going to be a bad time. Uh, we're also going to find something we need to use the fuel gas for. This one, I also want to know if it's full. And we get very, very little of this. But that would, this one could and probably should be brought up here. And I don't even think I can bring it up here. But we can try. Yeah, so we need to get, bring it up here and then start feeding some... Some... Yeah, some... What's it called? Fertilizer in here. Yes. And that will be right on this belt. This pipe here. And so everything is working really well here now. That's very, very, very pleasant to see that things are working. Uh, we obviously have not enough uh, of the organic fertilizer. Fer organic fertilizer is just basically a waste product. Instead of just throwing things out, then we are going to uh, convert it into compost, compost into organic fertilizer and some fuel gas. Not a lot, but eventually it'll be more. Once we get some of the better fertilizer, we'll be building that here and then merging it in. And then we'll just basically have them uh, both operating in here and this will be just basically a waste product so that we can always guarantee that our food production will always keep going like for example here can i even upgrade these yeah i can't do these faster there we go so as long as this one has like uh, so much uh, storage then sure let's do that if we also go back here to our house here food how are we doing? We're doing pretty well. They got enough food here, and that means they also it decrease how much they, they consume. They actually only consume 10, and we can produce 12, sort of, more or less. And then we kind of have enough uh, potatoes, that's fine, and everything else is also pretty good. So we'd like to get something. The next one would be the proteins, not really easy. Actually, chicken is going to be the next one. But we're not going to be focusing more on food at this point. What we're going to focus on is more power, because we now have the resources for this let's have a look at this one that was uh, just that uh, we have up here we got unlocked some more resources we can now do better power and we're just working our way towards the glass handling so we'll do glass and then we can also do the uh, nafta and reforming and cracking so we can do some better advanced oil instead of this little hack we have now cleared out this space over here which will now be our main location for building a, a giant uh, petrochemical refinery that will be lasting us for the remainder of the game that's at least the prospect of it so with that we're going to be wrapping up this episode thank you very much for watching thank you for following thank you for liking thank you for your great comments even though i not always uh, read them in time but i do read them thank you and uh, especially thanks to the patreon supporters who are supporting the channel and the work i do here until next time take care and stay effective